global to the smaller outlet. And that's In the golden era of the streaming world, the heat. content producers and distributors have come together in Hollywood for the fourth annual event of the National Association of Television Programming Executives, also known as NATPI. It's clear that the main trend is uh, international co-production and, and the rise of international content. It has democratized the content, if you will, globally. So whether Chinese content, Spanish content, Korean content can come through and be seen by global audiences. NatP Streaming brings together the industry leaders to mark the latest trends, challenges and opportunities. This is the fourth annual event for the National Association of Television Program Executives, also known as NATPE. It's a major gathering for content producers, distributors, streamers and buyers across all platforms. And in today's fast-changing business of television programming and media, the conference hosts a number of panels talking about producing content that attracts a global audience, as well as the promotion and monetization of media. And our network, CGTN America, is also hosting one of the panels of the day. In his opening remarks, CGTN America's president, Zhang Heping, said his network has adopted a digital-first strategy and is now prioritizing media integration. We are committed to producing high-quality programming for both big screen and small screens. And distributing across all media platforms. And given the critical issues facing our world, CGTN America's Executive Vice President Zhang Xin highlighted a newfound responsibility for the network. We think our mission now is no longer just to see the difference. We want to connect with people and make a difference. Doing something about the planet, it was when the ozone layer was thinning. And Moderated by CGTN America's principal news anchor, Mike Walter, a panel session called Food for Thought highlighted the network's most engaging programming around the issues of sustainability and culture. There's no other show right now that focuses specifically on Chinese-American food. They all work as a mini-documentary between six and eight minutes because that's the kind of appetite I think you can really have for a streaming audience. Full frame. CGTN America's Director of Feature Programming, Umberto Duran, spoke about the Global Action Initiative, an annual forum that delves into the most pressing issues of our planet. And former NBA star Robert Ori shared his experience promoting green practices among other players and spreading the message among fans who connect over sports. Love of sports can bring so many people together. And you don't even have to speak the language, but you know if a goal is kicked, uh, a, a, a touchdown is scored, a basket is made, a home run is hit, you know that's a good thing and you don't need to speak the language. Whether to inform or entertain, media companies now offer a myriad of platforms for broadcast content, and streaming has now become the most prevalent of them all. It is Tian Shan, CGTN, Los Angeles.